Hello guys, so in this video we are going to integrate bootstrap code template in Django. This is a two step process where first we download the template which is suitable for our project, remove the unwanted files and code, then the second process is we are going to integrate that template in Django. So on Google you can search for bootstrap code template free download and you can download any of the template from these links for our project of G of CRM we are going to use SB admin to bootstrap template which is the free template by start bootstrap this this is how it looks like so we'll download it and after extracting it will look like this if you open the index here it is the file okay so in the visual studio code it will look like this now there is unwanted code and unwanted HTML files so which we are not going to use so for that we are going to remove everything from this file and we are going to get this one okay so here we have removed the main content now you are thinking like everything is there but here the main content is not there so the process for this is that we are going to use this part and this part every time in our project but we need to change this content so which we are going to change so what we are going to do we are going to keep this in one template HTML template HTML file and we are going to extend it with this HTML file so this was the first part now we are going to integrate it in Django I will be sharing this template this theme and description you can download it from there now the part comes of integrating the template in Django now we have created the template which we have removed everything from the template the bootstrap template and remove the every unwanted code so now we'll copy this CSS folder in CRM Django and in the static folder and we'll paste it okay then we are going to copy this index.py file in templates folder and we'll rename it with base template base.html now in visual studio we can see it here the base template and in static we are going to see the CSS so now we have integrated the template we need to do some changes in base.html file so if you see we see here this we are loading something so this CSS is in static folder and if you see the tutorial I have explained how to load those static and those static files and folders so what we'll do we'll copy this code and paste it here above okay then we are going to load this file so for that curly brackets percentage sign static keyword quote then here quote then we'll close it with percentage sign and close bracket this is how we can load the static files images javascript files from the static folder in base dot or template folder save this one so similarly if you have javascript and everything we can change it okay now what we can do we can create a block of content which we are going to use which we are going to use for extending in template so here I have shown how to create a block of content okay in here 
we are going to keep the content so this is the content folder where we are going to keep everything okay so we'll keep it here the block of content and we'll copy this one beginning of till here Ex uh, we'll cut it and we'll paste in different folder file we'll create one file example dot html and will but before keeping the code we need to extend this template folder with the base template so we can extend it using extend keyword base dot template then we are going to create the block of content block content then we'll close it using end command and block content and block okay and content okay and we'll paste we'll paste the HTML code here okay let's take a simple example we'll create a URL with template view go to let's take an example go to the urls.py file and template view and in that template view we are going to create a path save okay we are not going to save it using base.template we are going to extend this example save and if you see the terminal everything is working fine so we'll go to the local host 8000 port and you can see it here contact management system and everything is here some error is there so we can remove that error by here so something is missing and what we are missing is this one okay we'll type something here hello every one now see we are extending the base dot template the uh, code of this is in base dot html but we are, the code of this is in example where we are extending base dot template and save it let's refresh it and you can see hello everyone so this is how you can integrate bootstrap port template and Django.